Hey guys, it's the Average Joe back with another video, and I just wanted to shoot this video uh, just to give you guys uh, a greater view of these three Cardi cases. Uh, I have the Synthesis Sheath and the new. Sorry, I forgot the name. Sorry, it's a pro Paragon case. So the Synthesis Sheath Paragon. Um, so this is part of the, the three big phones in their lineup um, and I just wanted to kind of compare and show you guys to give you a better idea of what you need to look at and what you're looking for or um, you know wh whatever you might be question uh, you know questioning so as far as rigidity I think overall rigidity I would say I want to go this way from most from most rigid to the least rigid because um, the Paragon case, there you go. That's how much it flexes. Um, the Synthesis case, there's a little more flex. And the sheath has the most amount of flex. So if rigidity is a big thing for you, this is the order you want to go in. And I think design-wise, I feel like, you know, unless you really appreciate these little accents, I feel like there's not that big of a difference. Um, the other big difference is the texture of the cases. So on this one, we have uh, these this, these little grooves right here. Um, so the grippiness and then the back is completely smooth. The smoothest back is going to be the Paragon case. And then it's going to be the synthesis and then the sheath. I think for the best overall grippiness, I'm liking the, she the, the sheath the most. And then it's going to be the Paragon. And then it's going to be the synthesis for me um as far as i everything else i feel like the, the the thinness the lay on the table all that stuff they're pretty much same across the board i don't think you can go wrong with any one of them but if rigidity and grip and things like that is very big and important to you um, i feel like it should be sheath uh, paragon and then synthesis for the grip um, and then max safe they're pretty much the same all across the board as well um, they do have different color options, you know, for the cases. So that might change what you decide and what you want. So make sure to check out the links below so you know what the color options are for each case. Um, but I just wanted to give my two cents, two cents on these cases. So for me personally, I would pick the Paragon because it, for me, it's got enough of the grippiness that I need. And for, it's just completely minimalistic. I mean, granted, I like the mutedness of these two colors, the, the sheath and the synthesis um, of the back, because I don't know if you can tell, the, the back of the Paragon is a little reflective. It's still a matte texture, but it is a little re reflective. But I like the overall cleanness. Like, there's no accents. There's nothing like that. There's not really, you know, if you look, there's not really any branding on it either. So it's a very minimal case. So that's why, for me, my personal pick would be this. Um, but again, I gave you some of the rankings, you know, only a couple of them. It's not the deepest dive into comparing these cases, but I hope it's enough for you to maybe decide on which one might be the best for you. So if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer whatever questions I can. Um, but as far as form, fit, functionality, they're pretty much the same across the board. The only big differences are the rigidity and the grip. Um, other than that, you know, and the, and, the, and the design, obviously. So make sure you guys, you know, do the best you research you can. Go through each one thoroughly and then decide which one you want. They do have a wonderful return policy as well. So if you do decide to buy one but then you don't like it, you know, it's free return. So uh, that's great of them to offer that. But anyway, I hope this video was helpful to you guys. I know it was kind of short. It wasn't like the deepest dive, but I think uh, I just wanted to give you my two cents from my experience with these, with these cases. All right, guys. So thanks for stopping by. Take it easy.